Exploring how the geography of voter turnout impacts election results. Voter turnout plays a key role in the functioning of democracies. If only a minority of citizens vote, the elected government might not accurately represent the views of the population. In contrast, when voter turnout is high, a country's government has a strong mandate to make decisions on its citizens' behalf. The geographical distributions of voters and voter turnout also significantly affect the outcome of elections. While levels of political engagement in specific geographical regions might not change much over time, in competitive elections, even the smallest change can be decisive. Dr. William Durkin of Maynooth University in Ireland recently explored the changing geographies of voter turnout in U.S. presidential elections from 2012 to 2020, using the state of Michigan as a case study. In 2016, a significant increase in voter turnout in rural parts of Michigan played a key role in the victory of Donald Trump, who received 47.3% of statewide votes, a mere 0.3% more than Hillary Clinton. While this increased rural support for Trump was also observed in the 2020 presidential elections, it was counteracted by an increase in voter turnout in urban areas, ultimately contributing to Biden's victory with 50.6% of votes, 2.8% more than Trump. Like many other regions, Michigan has been affected by urbanization over the past few decades, with more people moving to urban environments and rural populations declining. The growth in urban populations has largely been accompanied by a growth in the state's overall support for the Democratic Party. Despite Michigan's rising support for the Democrats, the state's vote margins have been tight in the past two presidential elections, with voters almost evenly split between the Democratic and Republican parties. In his analyses, Dr. Durkin showed that rural areas in northern Michigan, stretching from East Lake to Sheboygan, had an unusually high voter turnout in both the 2016 and 2020 elections, with a vast majority of voters supporting Trump. In Michigan's urban areas, however, increased voter turnout in 2020 would prove decisive for Biden's victory, securing the state's valuable 16 electoral college votes. Dr. Durkin compared these voter turnout geographical patterns to those observed in the general elections in the Republic of Ireland between 2007 and 2016. In the Republic of Ireland, the gap between rural and urban voters also narrowed during this time period with a turnout decrease in rural areas accompanied by a rise in urban voter turnout. In the historically significant 2020 election, this continued upsurge in urban voters significantly impacted election results, leading to a greater number of votes for parties such as Sinn Féin. Overall, Dr. Durkin's study shows a significant impact of the geography of voter turnout on election results, particularly when two opposing parties are separated by tight margins and both have high chances of winning.